I was one who was uh, enamored uh, by the governor in the very beginning. Even as a conservative Republican, I look forward to a new governor who, who would uh, help us reform Albany. And since then, he's been a kamikaze pilot without cruise control. And I tell a lot of people that uh, the governor left me. I didn't leave him. I feel 70% of New Yorkers feel the same way. What I hope is that this, uh, this entire fiasco doesn't uh, become just a political issue of Republicans versus Democrats. Uh, this isn't even about illegal immigration. As a state assemblyman, I think I'm one of the only assembly members in the New York State Legislature that has, uh, at least in our body, that has legislation on the illegal immigration issue. Uh, it's an issue that's very important to me. I had a, a local mayor in, in, in my district who decided he was going to work with the Guatemalan consulate. This is about five months ago. Uh, to hand out uh, Guatemalan uh, consular cards and uh, work with the government of Mexico to hand out matricular cards. At that time, that, that mayor was uh, instituting what I believe to be an illegal foreign policy by, to illegal aliens uh, by this local government. And I, I fought that uh, tooth, and, tooth and nail. And of course, you know, you also had stated in the beginning of the program that it's not an issue about being against immigration. Right. We all came from families who, who came to the, this country and became citizens. Yeah. The fact of the matter is, is that when people come to this country and don't do that, at least in my mind, I'm thinking, well, then why are you here? We, we're, we are a great nation because of our, our uh, immigrant population. We have to do everything we can as a nation and as a state to embrace legal immigration. But it's very simple. Illegal immigration is illegal. And when you begin to subsidize and promote illegal behavior while penalizing those who follow the law, you're no longer a nation, you're no longer a state of laws. So this is an issue that I have been out on the front on. This is an issue where we have declared a huge victory on the driver's license front. We have to keep pushing forward and I, I look forward to doing that over, over the next six months and over the next session and year. And perhaps this is a 